Hi all, welcome back to another video. Have you heard about the word stone accounting? Yes, it's a practice of using negative debit or credit by reversing the posted entries. So, just consider you are an accountant or bookkeeper of your firm and you have mistakenly posted an entry of 120 USD instead of 102 USD. So, how would you manage in your ERP system? Is it able to find the change in the reversal entry? Odo provides one of the inquisitive feature of Stoner Accounting which shows the reversal entry as in negative. So you can use Stoner Accounting to check the reversal of the duplicated entries as well as the reversal of any invoices and if you have uh, mistakenly posted the entries. So this can be easily managed in Odo and let's check how to manage this in Odo. So you can see the feature uh, under configuration settings called Storno Accounting. So we need to know what is the purpose of Storno Accounting. The purpose of Storno Accounting is to correct errors made in the financial accounting transaction. And Storno Accounting involves reversing a previously recorded transaction by correcting an equal and opposite entry in order to cancel out the original transaction. Just consider an example. If a company accidentally records a sales transaction twice, they can use the Storno accounting to reverse one of the entries and correct the mistake. By doing so, the company can ensure that their financial records are correct and reliable. Okay, so Storno accounting is also used to adjust the entries that need to be changed, uh, such as adjusting the entries for accrued expenses or depreciation by reversing the original uh, entry and making the necessary adjustment, company can ensure that their financial statements accurately reflect the financial position and performance. Okay, now let's uh, create two invoices without enabling this owner economy. So for that, uh, let's create no new customers. So let uh, the customer be, yeah, Jane be one of the customer. So save the customer and choose a product. Let the product be power bank or yeah, customizable desk. Remove the tax and let me confirm the invoice. And now you can um, reverse this invoice by clicking add credit note. So here you can specify the reason. Uh, so let the reason be bad product. Now reverse this. Now also uh, create one more invoice with the same customer. So let's create a new invoice with the same customer, Jane. And add the product. Let's add the same product itself. Removing the tax. Let's confirm this. So you not need to, uh, yeah reverse this and now let's create a new invoice uh, by enabling uh, this stone accounting for that just go to the configuration settings and just enable this stone accounting now let's go to the invoices and let's create an invoice with tom as the uh, customer or Tommy be the customer and let me add a product customizable desk itself you can choose any of the product okay now let me confirm this and uh, add a credit note for this product not required now reverse this and yeah, now let's also create one more invoice for the same customer, Tommy, without reversing the invoice or journal entry. So let me choose the product and just close this tax and let's confirm. Okay, now under accounting, you can go to journal items and take the pivot view. Okay. Now you have to enable under measures, balance, credit, as well as debit. 
and you can also uh, choose the customers uh, can filter based on partner and journal entries okay you can choose uh, the partner and you can see Jane and Tommy is visible here and you can also uh, get the journal entries of uh, Tommy as well as Jane now here you can see so as we have enabled uh, the Stono accounting for the customer Tommy and we have created an invoice twice and uh, we have reversed one in order to correct the mistake so we have we can see that uh, this uh, Tommy for the customer Tommy we have used a practice of Stono accounting which means that we have used a practice of using negative debit or negative credit uh, for uh, uh, reversing the journal entries and in case of the customer Jane as we haven't used Stona accounting and we have also reversed one of the invoice but it it hasn't shown in negative uh, credit or debit so uh, this is not the right method the right method is to uh, use Stona accounting to correct error hope the concept of Stona accounting is clear for you thank you for watching the video